Well, it didn't quite all go to plan last year, so we thought we'd come back and give it another rip. Yeah. Well, we've learnt a lot last year, and we've got a lot to build on. We know what not to do. Yeah, like, um, crash. <laughs> <laughs> we've decided not to build a plane this year, we're just going to get pay someone else to make us one. And uh, we'll just concentrate on things like the tracking antenna and the software and the electronics, that sort of thing. And hopefully we can get the plane delivered and um, have a successful mission. Hopefully it all comes together at the last minute. Yeah, like always. As always. <laughs> <laughs> so all we need now is a plan. Mm. Mm. <laughs> hey, can you do this? Hey, look, it's bending. I don't know. Need a fresh idea. Mm. Ooh. Hello. Yes. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. We said we were coming. Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. Alright. He's not very happy. <laughs> How long have you been waiting? Anyway, I think you've been lost for three, four years. <laughs> well, we better get into it. Alright, let's go. Let's go. So, um, what do you think of your friends mooching off you again for more work? Scotty the mooch at <laughs> Looking good, buddy. Just in my heart. Off. <laughs> right, how do you do it? <laughs> okay, there's Mr. Green heading off in the distance, and the old antenna is following him. We're just going to Bunnings to um, get some supplies because we need to make a little shelf for the back here. So we've got somewhere to sit our laptops on. And um, yeah, we'll get in there and see if we can find a bit of wood that'll sort us out. What do you reckon, Ian? A bit of wood. A bit of wood. <laughs> yeah, it's got measuring. Um, at least we'll do this. Oh. How big does it have to be? About 1400, tw oh, 1200. That gives enough space. 1200 is probably a good length. Alright. So, what's the go? We were going to paint it, but we found this MDF that's already. Malamine, and it's uh, 1298. She do this. We're going to have to go. I think we can do better. There's more down here. Let's have a look. What do we need? 1200. 1200. How about $10.90 for that one? Or was it the 850? Or was it 850? I don't know. Measure it up. Here. 1210. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Let's get that. Sounds good. <laughs> okay, does it fit? Does it look short? A little bit. How'd you measure 1200? 
Oh, I gave it a little bit of space. Oh, okay. <laughs> imagine, 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 with the tape measure. <laughs> um, I still think it's okay. Yeah. Oh yeah? Just joystick, having some joystick. That be. Hello, we're gonna make this. Did you check that one? Perfect. Oh. So, what do you think, buddy? It's looking pretty good. We've got the mission. Mission Control Centre. Yeah, <laughs> let's just uh, have a bit of a look around. I'll come around, open your door. I'll come around. Look at that. So we we'll figure we'll have extra cords that we haven't got here at the moment, so we'll have to hide them at the back there, I think. So apart from that, I think we're pretty good. Looking good. Mm. Now we're going to do is get to Queensland <laughs> yeah. somehow. All right, so it's the what Thursday before the challenge. We're in the car, we're all packed up, and we're ready to go. What do you think of that? A tight squeeze, and there's a rattle there somewhere that we've got to find we're out later. We're gonna find that rattle before <laughs> we get much further, or I'll have to kill someone. <laughs> <laughs> what do you reckon it is? Going up like that. Just put that foam in there to stop that going. Yeah. Put that in to stop that going. I'll put this in here. <laughs> Checking that it'll stay there. And it still rattles. <laughs> Alright. Well, we've made it all the way to the Peak Hill Caravan Park, and Ian's turned his laptop on. Mm. And it just keeps saying this. And it's not good because our presentation and everything's on there. So we're in a bit of trouble. We'll sort it out, as always. <laughs> and we're off on day two. Oh, let's get it on. Let's go and find us. See if we can find a computer shop in Dubbo. <laughs> get this computer fixed because we're in trouble. <laughs> oh, it's fantastic, isn't it? Welcome to Sunny Peak Hill. Alright. Well, we've just found Robbo's computers in Dubbo. And I reckon they'll be able to help us out. What do you think? We sure hope so. <laughs> Well, let's give him a ring and see what happens. Okay, here we are in sunny Dubbo. There we are on the little blue dot, and there's Robbo's computer. So if we turn right here, Ian, we should be able to find Robbo. And go, hey Robbo, give us a 2.5 inch external hard drive reader so we can see if we can restore Ian's hard drive get somehow. Get our presentation back. Get our presentation back, because it's got because we don't have PowerPoint on the other laptop, so we're in real trouble. So, where's Robbo? Are you excited to meet Robbo? Can't wait. <laughs> oh, there it is. Where? Up there with the blue sign. Oh, yeah. Cool. Robbo's computers. Hopefully, he can help us out. I think he's wrecking your computer. <laughs> Do you think, um, you think Robbo's doing a good job? <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> so what do you think? You're looking good? Half good. We've got the data anyway. So what did we get? We've got the uh, hard screeder. Now we're going to put this into that. Put it into your laptop. Let's see what happens. Ian Green's mobile computer repair store. <laughs> In the middle of the countryside. I might have to take it. Oh, I've got to take it out of this case. You want a screwdriver? Yeah. Haven't got any. No. It's the Ian Green mobile computer repair store. On the road just out of Dubbo. We've plugged our laptop, hard drive from the other laptop into this machine here. And we're just going to run a scan on it and try and fix up all the errors. Hopefully we get our PowerPoint presentation back. It's a good rule about backups. We always have backups. <laughs> Let's see kids else. back up. <laughs> we always tell everyone else to back up. Driving up to the Outback Challenge with minus one laptop. Still going down there. Yeah, it's going to be another three hours or so. But we can't read it at the moment, so it's not looking good. 
Last minute changes. Oh, can't reach. <laughs> so if we plug that into there, we should have 240 volts. Oh, look at that. Now we can run the laptop forever. And hopefully fix the drive. Yeah, because the old battery's getting low. Look at that. It's doing the thing, but the old battery's running out, so we have to pull over and improvise. The biggest challenge about this competition is ourselves. <laughs> Well, we've made it to Narrabri, and the old laptop scanner thing didn't work. No, it's not looking good. Hard drive's gone. I think that's gone to a better place. So we might have to sit up all night and try and download a free version of PowerPoint and recreate our whole presentation again. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. That's going to be crap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. Just to give you an idea of how close we are in this year's competition, it's Sunday night before the competition and we're still doing the last minute touches. And we've got, um, here's our rig with just a little bit of wiring to change. Here's our presentation still being worked on. And here's our documentary being rendered. So, um, what do you think, Eve? Game on, we'll get there. <laughs> See you tomorrow, everybody. See you tomorrow morning. Bye. <laughs>